Hey, it's Woody Powers. Thank you for joining me. There has been a process I have been working on for around a year now, and I've never been able to quite perfect it, but I'm getting pretty close. It's a self-sustaining lake without mods. The biggest problem with building a lake is that it floods once too much water has been pumped in, so I've been messing around with the balance, and I think I am almost there. So I've been playing for five days now since I built this lake, and it is managing itself miraculously. The water levels stay about right where they are, and I haven't had to make a single adjustment. So that got me working on a formula, and this is what I've come up with, a four to one ratio, four fresh water outlets and one water pump per medium to small sized lake. I'm also going to monitor my total water output from the city. As you can see here, I've got over 800,000 cubic meters of water being consumed and about 1.5 million cubic meters being pumped into the city. I'm gonna watch that number really close so that I can add more water pumps when demand rises as my city grows. I thought right now would be a pretty good time to conduct another experiment with a reservoir in the middle of this large roundabout leading into my city center. And if this works, I think it's gonna look pretty good. So I'm gonna use my terraforming tools to dig out the area. And a couple of deeper areas at the edges for my freshwater outlets. And an even deeper area in the middle for my one water pump. For some reason, the pump seems to work better if you have a hole that slightly slopes going in. I'm also going to add some earthquake sensors from the disasters menu to help bridge the electricity gap. Cool little trick there. Now, once the outlets are hooked up to pipes, we are gonna let them do their work, but I don't wanna turn on my pump just yet. So step one, turn on all four freshwater outlets and let the area flood. Step two, once the area reaches flood stage, I'm going to turn off two of the freshwater outlets and turn on my pump and let it drain for a minute or two. Step three, I'm going to turn my water pump back off and adjust the outlets to get just the right balance of water, and hopefully the evaporation factor built into the game will keep this lake reservoir right where it needs to be. Again, this is not guaranteed to work, but so far it has not let me down, and I'm going to keep an eye on that water being pumped versus consumed in my city. I want to keep that as close to where it is right now, and if I need to, I can make adjustments here at my hidden water pump farm. Hey, thanks for watching. Subscribe and like if this helped you out and have a good one.